Atlas's Hidden Secret Boston Dynamics Robot Atlas Robots are the future. We see movies based on how human lives will change if the world has robots. The picture is amazing at some points, yet scary too. But in the video that Boston Dynamics released, the picture of robots doing parkour is fantastic. Yes, that's right, now you can imagine human-like robots running around and jumping quite easily once you see this video. Hello and welcome back to our channel. If this is the first time you are watching our video, then do take a moment to subscribe and press the bell icon to get all the updates about our channel. This video is all about Boston Dynamics and its newest adventure in the field of robotics with Atlas, a humanoid. Keep watching to find out more. Time to begin the video. For those of you who do not know, Atlas is a humanoid robot that exhibits human-like coordination and speed. It was developed by Boston Dynamics, an American robotics company with funding from the US, Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, DARPA, and was unveiled in public in 2013. Over time, Boston Dynamics has made various developments in the robot and excelled in robotic locomotion. The Amazing Atlas is about 5 feet tall and around 190 pounds in weight. It is hydraulically actuated with 28 degrees of freedom. It has RGB cameras and depth sensors that provide the required information to chart the process of completing tasks like parkour routine through its three computers. Atlas is based on the previous humanoid robot of Boston Dynamics called Patman. It was built and introduced in the year of 2013, and its capability was compared to that of a child who did not even know how to walk. Since then, it has been almost a decade, and the Atlas has improved a lot. It has a total of 28 joints, and it can now perform some of the real complex actions. It has sensors that measure and take in information about the surroundings, and the computer software creates and runs the required algorithm to complete the required complex routine on its own. But first, the skill and the software need to be reliable and perfect for that. And the successful completion of the parkour routine is another feather in the cap of Boston Dynamics. Atlas is built to aid in the emergencies like search and rescue operations, performing tasks like shutting off valves, opening doors, and operating powered equipment in environments that are hostile to the human body. Some of the tasks that Atlas can perform efficiently after years of research and development are opening a door and entering a building, driving a utility vehicle at the site, removing debris that is blocking an entryway, locating and closing a valve near a leaking pipe, and many more. The Defense Department of the US has declared publicly that they will not use Atlas in any kind of defensive or offensive warfare. People all around the world are looking forward to the work that Boston Dynamics is doing. The video by Boston Dynamics clearly says that achievements with Atlas are instrumental in the research and development for robotic locomotion. It is not only revolutionizing robotics, but playing an essential role in the growth of the company as well. The robot has sensors all over its body that help chart and control its movement, balance, acceleration, complex movements like jumping, getting up, walking, and interacting with its surroundings. The template motions of the Atlas are made and perfected using trajectory optimization and combined into complex routines like dancing and parkour. The things the engineers have learned while designing and improving Atlas are immense and a very crucial part of developing higher power density mobile robots. Designing the control algorithms to perform extended athletic behavior like parkour perfectly, perfectly balancing while running, walking, or doing other tasks. Charting the course using sensors and computation algorithms correctly to complete small and big locomotory tasks, trying to achieve both long-term and short-term goals. And above all, build robots that can sustain hard falls. The last one is super crucial in the learning phase to build robots. As explained by the Boston Dynamics team in the video, the main focus in this whole process was on two most important things, repeatability and reliability of the movements by Atlas to complete the movements set of Parkour Mountain. While the movements, walking, balancing, running, doing somersaults by the robot are the small movements that have been worked on and improved a lot by the team over time. The challenge, according to the team, was putting these movements together and doing each movement perfectly at the required place in synchronization and developing an algorithm for the same. It can be looked upon as a repetition of all the small movements and projects done with the robot in a gross locomotory project, honing and combining every skill. It is a great achievement, and the team at Boston Dynamics has successfully nailed the challenges with their day and night of hard work. And the steel body moving on various hurdles effortlessly like a human in the video is beautiful. The scenes of the parkour video tell us all about the hurdles that the Boston Dynamics team of engineers faced while working on Atlas. 
One of the engineers called it a true team effort, and a lot of learning, especially about designing the robots, that can survive the fall and get back up to complete the task. They also tell us what majestic sight we see in the YouTube video is a well choreographed routine that they planned and completed after practicing every bit and every inch over a hundred times. This is a lot of hard work, and Boston Dynamics is continuously keeping people in awe of their successes with Atlas and its seemingly effortless movements. Software Team First of all, the videos tell about the software team and the hard work they put in to understand the required algorithms for balancing the robot while walking and putting one foot in front of the other. Yes, as a human this might seem too easy and obvious, but clearly, it is not. The software team creates the behavior and the control software which is instrumental in leading the behavior of the robots and reliably executes all the required movements to complete the parkour mountain. Hardware Team The next in line is the hardware team and that is very important to build strong and sustainable robots. The outside structure needs to be strong and designed in a fashion to help sustain the robot and its hydraulic structure from breaking and bleeding whenever it falls. The hardware team makes strategic upgrades to the robot that make it capable to carry out complex dance and parkour routines successfully. They have learned from the mistakes and falls of the robots so much over time to help build a robot capable of successfully doing parkour routine. The challenges they have encountered include electrical failures, hydraulic packages, breaking of mechanical parts when robots crash, and many more. It often takes days to fix a broken robot and fight the root cause of the damage according to one of the technicians. But their team remains positive and learns from mistakes, eventually improving the design and speeding up the diagnostics and repairs next time. Operations Staff A strong environment is really necessary to support the weight of the robot. The operations staff is responsible for building the surroundings for routines like parkour and fixing the environment too whenever the robots crash through and things are broken. All of this takes research and strategic planning for successful completion. This may not seem very important, but it is instrumental in running hundreds of the required tests to learn from mistakes and successfully demonstrate the routine. The work on the robots in Boston Dynamics is just foundational and crucial in the future of development of the humanoid robots. An engineer claimed that these projects are just about working on the capabilities of the robots and extending them to carry out the basic routines that any humanoid robot should do. But the building phase is really hard, and there are so many things still unexplored. The team at Boston Dynamics is positive, enthusiastic, and hardworking. They love what they do and are quite sure about the revolutionary role that their work will play in building and improving the design of humanoid robots. The real-time perception of Atlas helps Atlas examine its surroundings with adept sensors and register and detect its surroundings in point clouds, which further helps in the movement of the robot. It is like registering its surroundings to locate the places of support, chart the route to support, and coordinate its feet after identifying obstacles in real time. Further, it exhibits the model predictive control, which means that Atlas uses models of its movements to predict how its motion will evolve and it adjusts according to that. The robot actively balances while carrying out complex routines and also performs the massively complex calculations alongside adjusting the force needed to balance and transfer its weight while moving around. All of this may sound so easy to humans, but replicating the movements in Atlas and stabilizing it over time was not an easy task. The Boston Dynamics team is thrilled and ready to work continuously on the capabilities of Atlas in doing other complex human motions as well. And that's all for this video. If you liked this video, make sure to like, share and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to press the bell icon to get all the updates about our videos. What do you think about Boston Dynamics' work on Atlas? Let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again in the next one.